Hello everyone! Today we are going to look at temporary tables in the form of hash tables. Um, so these are tables which we can create on the fly which are then dropped when our session ends or when you explicitly drop them. Uh, it is of course good practice to remember to drop them when you know you're done with them uh, but if you forget then they will be dropped when your session closes anyway. Um, so let's take a look. We have um, two options for these. Um, a hash table is only available within your current session um, whereas a hash hash table is global and can be used in other sessions. So let's have a look at this. We've got our TBL customer and I'm just going to say select into hash j. Okay, um, and then let's just select star, oops, star from hash j. And we can see that we've got some records there in that record set. If I open a new session here and then do select star from hash j, we can see there that that's an invalid object because we're in a different session here. Um, you can see here that my SPID is 66. Um, whereas here my spid's 51. So if I do the same thing um, and make it a hash hash table which is global, we'll be able to see that I can access that now um, from a different spid. So it's always best practice to remember to drop your table. So you drop it in just the same way. Let's drop hash j from in here, show you how to do that. Um, and then just to show you that it does um, drop itself when the SPID dies, um, we're on SPID 51 here. So we can see here the table's still active there. And then if I say kill 51, we will see now that, oh God, if I click the right thing, um, we can see now that our table has gone and if I head back over to this session and reconnect the session, um, I've now got, oh, I've got the same spit again, but um, the table has definitely gone. So yeah, that's pretty much it. They are nice and simple and very, very handy. Um, the next tutorial in this series, we're going to take a look at table variables. Um, so if you enjoyed this tutorial, please like and subscribe to our channel um, and thank you for watching.